welcome back to my channel today we'll be looking at vectors especially the magnitude of a vector of course we learned that a vector is any physical quantity that has size magnitude okay and direction it has size and direction it has magnitude and direction for example force is what a vector okay velocity is a vector acceleration is a vector all these are what vectors and of course if a is a given vector and it is written in this form okay here we have a1 in the x component and a2 in the y component of course this can also be written as a1i plus a2 what j okay a1 lot of i plus a2 lots of what j okay why this is the component form of this vector this is what the unit vector form of it so they are the same okay now of course to find the magnitude the size of this vector we say a magnitude will be equal to you use the pythagoras rule to find the size of that vector here we say a1 squared plus what a2 squared this is how you find the size of what a vector and of course if i have an example if p is a vector and the x component is 3 y the y component is minus 4 and we are to find the magnitude of p how do we find the size of this vector it is simple following this formula now the magnitude of p will be equal to the square root of 3 squared plus minus 4 squared right now this will be 3 squared is 9 minus 4 times minus 4 is what 16 of course if you add this together you have the square root of 25 and the square root of 25 is 5 so the size of this vector p is what 5 units okay in the next video i will teach you the unit vector please watch that don't forget to subscribe to the channel okay bye